all the critical indicators are going south, I wonder what the president is proud of. At a time like this, we need certain skills which are clearly not present in State House. In State House, we've got very skillful politicians. But a moment like this does not require politics or politicians. Mm -hmm. A moment like this requires people who can focus on policy. And it is through policy that you make deliberate and intentional moves, take measures to change the lives of the people. It is not going to be solved through the Sunday uh, prayer meetings. It is going to be solved through deliberate action to deal with some of these things. For example, it is easy to blame global forces for the fall of the Kenyan shilling. But it is not just global forces at play. It is our responsibility, and it is the responsibility of the national government or central government to take critical and strategic interventions mm -hmm. to prop up the economy. And one thing we are not talking about is that the Kenya shilling is losing because we are largely an import economy. We import virtually everything. Whereas in the past, a few years past independence, Kenya was a manufacturing country and you were exporting to neighboring countries. So we want to hear that in this one year that the president has been in the office, what have we done to spur our competitive, uh, the competitiveness of our manufacturing sector so that instead of importing everything and therefore uh, being at the mercy of global forces, we can start exporting so that we can earn foreign currency? Right. How do we also revitalize certain sectors that, uh, you know, in, in school you used to be told tourism is the greatest honor of foreign exchange?